Thanks for coming back to PokerNews.com. I am here with the third place finisher of the big one for one drop, Dan Smith. I'm sure you're a little disappointed right now, but you are taking home. Nice chunk of change, $4 million. How, what are you thinking right now? How are you feeling? I'm pretty pleased with everything. Um, I, can't, I very easily could have bubbled uh, the stacks. It could have been a long way. I got a few pay jumps. Uh, I'm happy with how I played. Got a bluff on ESPN. Uh, couldn't be happier. Well, that's not true. I totally could be happier, but I'm very happy. All right. Tell me a little bit about playing. You know, it's not often in poker tournaments you play with commercial breaks. Does that disrupt your flow at all, or you don't really think about it? I actually appreciated the breaks. Uh, three minutes to look at my phone and get strategy updates and adjustments. Uh, I think it'd be better for poker if you could be in like a totally isolated room. But given that that wasn't the case, I took full advantage of like those three minute breaks every 20 minutes. Well, you had a pretty rowdy rail with a, like a very chatty Scott Sieber. This was very tame for my rails. <laughs> <laughs> Scott is was behaving today. Well, it's, in, in comparison to everyone else, he seemed, uh, you know, the next level of like chatty. And he was making really good jokes. I'm sure you guys saw during the live stream. Well, you missed out in the 100K one drop a couple years ago. He was in much better form. Damn it. <laughs> oh, if only I could still go young, back. though. He's going to be watching ZJ. All right. So. All right. All right. Well, uh, I got the hat. A little so, too uh, late, let me, but a little too late. <laughs> I have it for the interview. That's all that matters. Mm -hmm. Tell me, Doyle Brunson give you his hat? How did this all happen? He overheard that I like cowboy hats. He asked me what size I am. Seven and three eighths. Apparently, we're the same hat size. And he, uh, he gave me this one. That has to be surprising that Doyle Brunson has your head size. Yeah, he's a big dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So is this like a lucky hat now? Are you going to keep this going? I know you've worn hats in the past. This is sort of your thing now. I think it's my lucky hat for sure. I can't, every time I play and I don't wear it, maybe half a dozen people come up to me, but I think it's a high stakes hat. It's the, it's the high stakes hat. I like it. All right. This is my low stakes hat. And uh, <laughs> congratulations. Taking home some money. And stay tuned to pokernews.com to see who wins this thing.